welcome or welcome back to my channel don't forget to like share and subscribe yes ma'am she is giving okay she is giving me my real 100 percent baby girl burgundy life hey 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 it's time to slay this is a new year okay if you are tuning into this this is probably 2024 right right about now uh, probably a couple of good days off into 2024 uh, yeah it's been a while but i'm back okay all right i'm pretty sure um somewhere on one of these videos i'm gonna you know just kind of give a little bit of what i've been doing but i ain't been doing much girl but living and surviving living and surviving but anyway so uh i have this cute all burgundy wig okay um i decided to do a symmetrical look on both uh sides with a cute little um swirly um that kind of just puts a little bit of a difference um between a symmetric look um but you can't go wrong with the swoop doopy doop um straight part because this is a fixed part wig uh i'll give get into the uh dates once we get into who she is who she's made by and all the goodness even though i always put an easter egg in the background of my uh talk slash uh tutorials um where i show you you know me styling the wig i always put the easter egg by putting um the stock card somewhere in view <laughs> um but yeah so voila she styled yes ma'am okay so this is the final look she is so gorgeous she is definitely like i said giving me my 100 percent baby girl burgundy life hey just drops just in the shade here and i'm back to show you ladies another cute wig okay so this is a little different for me even though i done did burgundy before i think on this channel but I'm used to some dark roots and that is not what I got. Even though I like it, it's real cute. And um, before I get into all that, could I at least say what her name is? Girl, her name is Anika, okay? All right? Kind of put me in the mind of um, Nicki Minaj's name, Onika, but instead of Onika, it's Anika, okay? All right? Or like uh, Anika Nani Rose, um, the one who did, um, the voice and everything for Tiana. She was in for girl. Anyway, let me get back on this wig. All right, so this is Anika. She is made by uh, It's a Wig. Okay, it said that this lace is 5G True HD transparent lace. Okay, right. Okay, all right, all right. This is my first It's a Wig, and you definitely know It's a Wig. <laughs> Okay, all right. <laughs> but yeah, so I have her in the color T99J slash Burgundy. Okay, okay, all right, all right. Before I come up with more corny jokes, let's get off into the further details for Miss Anika. Let's get into Anika's 360 right here. Let me give you ladies a few pros for this cutie. Okay, so um, I love the low and high tones within this one burgundy color. This is the first burgundy wig, all burgundy, no black roots uh, wig that I did. And I definitely like how the way it transitions from a really pretty dark burgundy. And then you can see like as it gets to the tips that it's lighter. So when you compare the tips to the, the root, it is a visible contrast. And I think that it's really, really pretty. I do like the curl pattern, even though they, when I first took the wig out the box it was a little tighter curls than this as you comb it as you brush it you know of course it's gonna change but i think the curl pattern and the way it folds back is really pretty it was really easy to melt this lace and blend it i did pluck a little bit of hair other than that you probably really don't have to pluck it i just did it because i 
I don't know, it just, I needed it to look a certain way when I styled it like up and then have it cascading on each side like this, you know? But the lace was pretty good. Like I said, this is my first, it's a wig, wig. <laughs> so if I had to compare this lace to another wig company, I think I would compare it to maybe Outry sleek lace series of wigs but yeah i think you know the lace is really good and um as far as the pros i can't think of anymore so i think it's about that time for you ladies favorite part of each and every one of my videos and that's when i get in your face let me get in your face like i said ladies she is a really good choice for a pop and go um sometimes you just need you a quick little pop plop and go um something that you know, doesn't require you to do like like a whole bunch of styling or come up with a whole concept or whatever. Something that you could slap on your head, do the baby hair and be out. So um, she is definitely your girl for that. Let me show you ladies how I stoned her. You know, from ear to ear. Even though if I was gonna be plucking, I probably should have plucked up in here because Girl, it's a little flappy right there, but you wouldn't know if I didn't tuck, you know, the hair back and show y'all. See, I share things with you gals, okay? I kind of let y'all into my business, my business, okay? So, um, it's the same way on this side. So, if I really wanted it to be perfected and I was just like really on my perfectionist stuff, I probably would have went in and plucked it like along here so it'll lay flatter. So, I do kind of got it kind of like blowing in the wind a little bit on the sides, but you wouldn't know that if, you know, I didn't show you ladies. She's still a cute little pop and go. You still can achieve, you know, some cute baby hair with the sideburn action, action, without it requiring a whole bunch of, you know, maintenance and styling it to achieve that. I think as far as the color, I am used to having dark roots. It just gives me comfort, but I'm not mad at it. It's a pretty, you know, you can't go wrong with 99J. You just can't, you know? So it's giving me my real baby girl burgundy life, you know, or whatever like that. But um, I like it, you know, I think it came out cute. And from a distance, it really does look really, really, you know, good. Like I really was like on some, like, let me like take my time to slay, but it really didn't take that long. And um, I, I think it's, you know, a very, very good quality lace. So um, with that, ladies, close up over. Let me get out your face. Okay, ladies, keeping it short and cute for these cons right off the rip. Even though I try not to fool in this hair because I really, really love the initial curls that this wig came with when I took it out the box. Girl, that's over and done um, because I definitely had to put a brush to the hair. It gets really, really dry and it gets really, really tangly just for no body reason, it really do. And of course, when you are dealing with synthetic hair, it's gonna tangle, it's gonna shed, it's gonna wanna act up. But this wig literally acted up as soon as I put it on and it sat on my clothes, it went to act it up. <laughs> so that is a little, you know, quick for me. So that's definitely a con. How I kind of got around the knotting, even though it's still kind of tangly, is putting um, a little bit of oil sheen in the ends, like from here to, to down to the tips, just to kind of like battle a little bit with that, um, with the need to bunch up and get a little ratty and plus, you know, playing with it a little bit. But she is a good pop and go wig as far as, you know, popping her on and going, you know, run some errands, pop her on and gone to somebody baby shower or something like that. She is definitely a quick little pop and go. But is she one of those wigs that you could sit up here and wear days on end like I like to do? No, she's not. All right, ladies, last but not least, the rating. What do I rate Anika? Hmm, I think I'm gonna give Anika a six and a half only because, um, like I said, the tangling right out the box was like immediate. And I kind of didn't expect that because the curls are so pretty and the texture of the hair is like more of that silkier texture. Um, but I immediately noticed tangling. I mean, 
after I styled the baby hair and I tied it up and I dropped it down on my clothes and I was ready to go, girl, she already was getting, you know? So I definitely had to grab my brush, spray a little aqua, you know, and comb her out. And I hated to do it because I love, 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 love the curls that um, it initially came with. It still looks, you know, really pretty and barrel curls or whatever. But she is definitely one of those wigs that you gotta keep your brush on the hip. You never know when you gotta fling it out and beat her back into submission. Okay, all right, all right. She is really a good wig. It's just she, like any other synthetic wig, um, tangles and sheds for nobody reason, right? Um, as far as profuse um shedding i mean it ain't profuse but it's enough to like to wear like if you comb her out brush her out or whatever you better make sure you do this just so you don't be walking with like strands of you know burgundy hairs like down your shirt and you know on your clothes or whatever so once i brush her this barrel blowback look was kind of not really falling back because once you brush it and comb it you kind of comb out the curl initial curl pattern and you kind of like comb a little bit away at the style too so i mean she's still cute though she's still giving what she gave on this stock card though you know <laughs> so yeah i would still recommend her to you ladies if y'all want a quick little baby girl burgundy pop and go in your life okay all right so that is my review for anika by it's a wig thank you so much for watching my tutorial and my review for miss anika don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and also follow your girl on instagram at juice in the shade as well bye